Cooper, Cat Weasel, his ring name, <laughs> and his such his usual tricks, which always get me laughing, and that's the crowd here too. And this is Toad, his mascot, going on the corner post, behind him, and the sack, down, holding it up, and now he's raising her. His opponent, Bobby Barnes, very neatly folding and taking great care of his Louis XIV dressing gown, looking very flash. Not to mention the hair colour, but with all their gimmicks for entering the ring and trying to catch the eye, these two men have great ring ability, there's no doubt about that. Six three-minute rounds, two falls to the side. Emil Poilv, the referee. each, six of them, two falls to the side. his way out of trouble here. <laughs> well, I'd be very surprised if Cat Weasel can make his opponent smile in this part. Never smile, or very, very seldom. sorts of asides coming from Cat Weasel. <laughs> Arms reaching high up to get that full Nelson. He's giving you almost over a stone here, a stone in the court here, Barnes. Mostly in height, of course. First round, 
So the side headlock not coming to anything in this round. Great the whole boys. Great. All right, boys. Bobby Barnes, who is now more or less a full-time wrestler, checking out with the hairs in place and step not ruining it. Under the arms go the Gilbert. Uh, Kind thought for his opponent. Way, Round two, five to go. No score. Cat Weasel. Oh my God! From Hexthorpe to start side Doncaster, 14 and a quarter stone. Barnes at 13 stone. <laughs> And there is the double wrist lock by Barnes. Starts using his uh, skill that he know he has, but I think he's trying to do now. He won't worry about his coiffure too much, and his opponent won't have time for the comedy. This is a very strong, experienced man, this guy. Now, a folding press won't work with the arms up there. Folded those can't be touching. Spinning in, but he's decided against it. Give him a head by a little too deliberate about that. Cat. <laughs> oh, no, no time to get some uh, applause for that. Want, of course, to ask for applause when he gets out quickly from the throw, but he hadn't got time to get it that time. He's got about 40 seconds, Barnes, now to make this count if he's going to get a score in this round. Tedley's just smiling at that, but Barnes isn't. <laughs> this man who uh, we first saw on television way back in 71. One year amateur experience, he turned pro in 1970 actually. I'll be visiting and entertaining the kids in orphanages, and this he does an awful lot of. It's really great for the uh, charity. And he gets invited to appear a lot at uh, various charity shows and fates, and he very seldom says no. Four rounds to go, no score. Barnes on the attack. No, no, no. No, no. Ah, no. No, 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 
last night. Oh, no, 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 Still the forearm that landed despite his uh, threatening the punch. Oh, you won't like that one. He likes to look immaculate right through the box, and that's uh, just the impression of people, his fans especially, that he hasn't really been ruffled and it was quite easy for him. And I think it's the idea. Nice posting by the cat. Oops. One, two, three, four, five. No, 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 no. And the back hammer is on, held by the bar's left leg and the right arm in the lead. And the submission possibility here to Barnes. And the lead back. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Submission in just under two minutes of the third round. In the third round, the first submission of the contest goes to the red corner and Bobby Barnes. Wish your PC was faster and more trouble free? Over time, clutter, errors and malware can slow your computer down and cause crashes. Now, AOL is offering PC users a free 30-day trial of AOL Computer Checkup. It's an easy-to-use automatic repair and tune-up that can make your computer faster, safer and more optimised. Speed up your PC, fix common crashes and freezes, increase security and privacy. Visit computercheckup.co.uk to start your free 30-day trial. Here, yeah, Churchill, is it true that most of your customers pay less than £305 for their car insurance? Oh, yes. And you've got UK call centres? Oh, yes. Yeah, right. Tell me you won a tug of war competition at the weekend. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh, yes. See if you could save with Churchill. Call our UK call centres or go online. At Green Flag Breakdown, we will work harder than we've ever worked before. If you break down, help is never far away because we have hundreds of garages across the country. From a flat tire to a flat battery, we do our best to fix you and get you on your way. And you can join us online from just 20 pounds. Go Green Flag! We may not be the biggest, but we're determined to be the best. Call us or visit greenflag.com. And I just invented car insurance. Go to Pear! Go to Pear! When you insure, you must insure to go to Pear! Waste no time, go to Pear! It's where you go to, it's where you motor! So you can insure, be insure, go to go to Pear! Did you know you can get money back when shopping online? It's easy and entirely free. Dad got £15 back when buying his MP3 player and trailers online. Now that's top cash back. Mom got £80 back when buying a new mobile phone online. Now that's top cash back. And the kids rented DVDs online, getting £6 back and scaring themselves silly in the process. Now that's topcashback.co.uk. Get cash back at thousands of stores just by clicking from top cash back. Besides, you would have bought it anyway. Well, so as I was saying, at Direct Line we have different levels of cover to suit you, and we give you 25% off home insurance. And it's working. It. My sacred crystal has got me a discount. Yep. Well, and there's a further discount of up to 25% off when you buy online. Another so discount. Yeah. I'm so sorry, but I would say that's very lucky. It really is quite straightforward. Get 25% off home insurance and up to a further 25% off online. Direct Line.
good submission hold, a tough submission hold. He never jerked that arm at all, which of course he's definitely not allowed to do. And he just slowly and deliberately got him in. It's a heck of a mess with the arm lever on one side and the back arm on the other. Three to go. And he's, he's got to go. The long four and Barnes going for the left arm some more. Three, four, five. No time for comedy anymore from Cat Weasel. He's really in trouble now. He's going to get an equalizer pretty soon. Same move, the throw in the backhand position, landing on that left arm in the backhand. Again, the same move, the backhammer held, held by the left foot, the opposite arm lever. Now, if he gets his leg in between there and leans back, this is what got the submission last time, but Cat Weasel has got through the ropes. Fortunately for Cat, he's got through the ropes there and gets the break. Oh, that left arm is really taking a battering now. But legitimately, by Bobby Barnes, unlike some of Jim Brake's moves. Yes, the referee, highly suspicious of that. Held under the top, top rope. Cat Weasel with one good arm now. Can he come back into this? Well, he can use some of this weight advantage now. He's got the left arm caught again. As long as Bobby Barnes, a half minute to go. Look, Bobby Barnes can continue that uh, left arm treatment. Cat Weasel's little chance here. Here comes the same submission hold attempt. He's got 20 seconds to make it pass. He doesn't know that, of course. 10 seconds, and again, Cat Weasel trying to get to the ropes. Six, five, four, and oh yes, he's got him. He's caught him off balance anyway. So the bell was there, but he didn't need the bell, the cat, because he got out of trouble by himself there. Forced his man off balance into the ropes while he was trying to crawl to the ropes. Now, how much damage does that cause, all that treatment to the left arm? That's the question. Everybody here would love to see him come back. Five. Ready or not, he's got to go now for the last two rounds, trailing by one submission fall to Barnes. Right over the shoulder, against the joint, and full distance downwards. Barnes leave go quicker than anything. Nice spot. Oh, yes. Oh. Yes, he tripped him nicely over the top and he pulled a, a folding press. Beauty by Cat. Nice work. He's back. He's back. The equalizing fall in just 46 seconds of round five. In the fifth round, the equalizing fall of the contest goes to the blue corner and Cat Weasel. Barnes complaining in the other corner, but uh, 
to the MC and the referee, anybody will listen, but this man is back for the equaliser, and we never thought he could with that left arm in such trouble. Still worrying him, obviously. One round to go. Seconds away for the sixth and final round. And still Barnes complaining about the hair. I don't know really why. It wasn't pulled, just ruffled. That's what he doesn't like. Beautiful Bobby Barnes. Wants to remember to remain beautiful for the whole of the box. Nice of the spine knee drop. Nicely. And the first double knee. Come on, one. Come on, one. Two. Now Barnes easily out of that. And he was okay with the forearm. Paul Nelson, he's got to reach for it, look how high he's got to get those hands up. Nice butt. Barnes held his ground then, a little bit of forearm as he came out. Trying to do the same again. <laughs> he turned the weapon, he kept over the top, holding press. Very near caught him. <laughs> turned away, beefing to the ref, and nearly got the winning fall scored against him. of course of the ropes. Continuing the action in the corner, not allowed. Grabbed the leg almost before he was up. And he's really turning that foot around now. Yes, very nicely. But again, Bobby Barnes comes back to that same toe and ankle hold. Just a minute left. One minute left in this final round. He's <laughs> still worried about his hair. But he's still got that... Uh, both hands are working on the toe and ankle. Now he's got both feet there. Unorthodox, but it's working. There's the orthodox hole that he was aiming for. Figure four, he's getting the bar through. The figure four leg lock. And this could get the second submission for Barnes and the winner. If the cat now submits. And he must be awfully near to doing so. 12 seconds. 10. 7. Five seconds, four, three, two, he's too late, it's a draw. So he came back, Herr Weasel, at least, and made a draw out of it. One fall each. After six rounds of wrestling, each wrestler scoring one fall apiece, the referee's decision, it's a draw. Bobby Bond and Cat Weasel. Thank you, John Curry, our Master of Ceremonies for this afternoon. Uh, Barnes' submission fall in round three, equalized by the round five fall by Kettles. And with that, we hope you've enjoyed it. We say goodbye from all of us here at Hatfield. Have a good week. Till next week. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, it's a draw. Bobby Barnes and Cat Weasel. Bobby Barnes.